15. Welcome back to Good Day Columbia. You know when the rubber gloves go on, there's fun oh. to be had. Here we go. Uh, it's time for the weekend chef. That is you and I that don't necessarily do it all the time, but this weekend would be a perfect time to jump into the kitchen and Absolutely. become a chef of your own. <laughs> chef Jason Scarborough, U.S. Foods and the Chef Store joins us this morning. Yeah. Of course, we've got Thanksgiving coming up, so kind of that, that flavor. We know we're going to have turkey, right? Yeah. Maybe ham. So let me help with the sides. Love it. Okay. Makes it easy, right? Yeah, absolutely. Okay, what we're going to do? So we've got a little bit of rendered bacon hey, wait, grease. This, this is bacon fat. This oh, is yeah. actually, hold on. <laughs> just take a, take a pick of that right there. This is actually just real straight up bacon fat. Don't worry, we have the bacon here too. So you'll get some of, some <laughs> so of the crispy bacon. bacon. Yeah, right, there you go. Somewhat, okay. somewhat. So a little shallot going into the pan. Yeah, we, where, do you want your, um, where do you want your flame? Do you want that like uh, a nice, medium? Like nice medium to high. Okay. At first, you want to know on high. If, if you feel everything's kind of charring a little too much, turn it down just okay, a little bit. Okay, what are we bit. cooking right Let's here? Let's start high. Uh, I've got two different types of bell pepper, a yellow and a red. Okay. And then I've got a little bit of shallot. Fantastic. All right. All right and we're, we're going to go right in with the broccoli. So Love this, this is kind of, of oh, right look at that. Bacon oh, fat oh, it's going it. anyway. Why not? <laughs> Guys, don't forget, the recipe is uh, right at watch.com right now for this whole thing, including a shopping list from Chef Jason. Uh, so you can go ahead and recreate Absolutely. this. Try it up this weekend before you take it out on Thursday. I'm the mother-in-law. A little salt? A little salt and pepper, actually. I've got it all blended up there for you. So I just want a nice little char. Fantastic. So you're going to cook okay. this a little bit. Now, this yep, this is a pretty much bit. raw. Do you have you pre-cooked the broccoli? I have blanched this, okay. but you can do it raw. And if you do it raw, just throw it right in the oven. So this is a ovenable pan, right oh, into fantastic. the oven, and Perfect. then done. Okay. Perfect. So real simple. I'm going to let this get a sure. nice is there, little is there color. Flavor? Okay, just a little bit of yeah, color on that. Just okay. a little bit of color because it imparts just a slight bitterness, which is a good bitterness. You want right. some good bitter. You want some salty. You want some sweet. What which are some is other, bell pepper. What's the flavors you can actually put in the broccoli? Because I, I like broccoli, but I don't think I'd sit and eat a stem. I like to put stuff on it. Yeah. To, Hide it. I'm about to throw some cheese on it. And bacon, bacon is the duct tape of the food Duck. world, right? So we're going to bring it together with some bacon. Who doesn't love bacon? <laughs> I love it. Chef's already got my heart here. Of course, uh, you were the chef store right up on uh, St. Andrew's Road. Yep, you got it. Some great items. Uh, everything here available at, at yeah. any store. Can you hand me that bowl store. right there? This one right here? Yeah, that one. Yeah, that, this one right here. Yeah, can you hand me that? I can't. All right. Well, what do you think about that? That is actually pretty cool. <laughs> Look at this. So say this is your countertop. Right? That bowl's not going anywhere. You just took the countertop off of the, the counter there. That is cool. So it's, oh, okay, so like a stabilizer. Yep. And that, that's exactly that what it is. It's a stabilizer. That is to be put it down, push it down like that, and there you go. And that's your bowl's it. not going to, yep. otherwise, Even a stirring, plate can go on it. Because when yeah. you're stirring, that's this it. happens all the time. It's an extra hand. Look at that. I love it. How much does that thing go for? Uh, twenty four ninety nine at the chef store. So that's that's Dude, a great that's gift bad. for anybody who has everything. That is not. That's a cool Because <laughs> I guarantee you they don't have including it. Including Tyler, because I'm going to get that. You see this nice little char that we've got here? Okay. We're finished. Fantastic. We're done, okay? So I'm going to go right in the. God, this is really easy, too. Yeah, you saw we're doing it. this right in live time, which means it's uh, it's taking just about two minutes. we got about 30 seconds left. Oh, absolutely. Uh, you want to so. hit some bacon on there? Heck yeah, I do. Get some bacon going on I'll in there. Get some bacon on there. And no I'm going to get some. Uh, she threatened me with a good time. Pork fries. Look at you with the bacon. Man, I'm telling you're going, you. You're going nuts. Like I said, Look at that. Like she threatened me with a pork product. Like a Parmesan snow right on there. And I'm going to hit it with a little fresh thyme. Look at that. Wow. How easy is that? Quick and easy, my so gosh. So it's like an upscale. I'm telling you, this is like a mother-in-law dish. should be proud about <laughs> Broccoli and cheese. <laughs> We've got some more stuff coming up for you. We're kind of decorate it for you all together on a, a nice turkey plate yeah. coming up as we continue on on the Weekend Chef. Again, I challenge you this weekend to put a coat on and become a chef. The weekend Chef is watched by the Chef Store. <laughs> Guys, stick around. We've got a lot more Good Day Columbia on the way. 726. Welcome back to Good Day Columbia. Continuing on with Chef Jason from uh, U.S. Foods and the Chef Store up in St. Andrews Road. Guys, we just showed you a couple minutes ago real time how to make this uh, this broccoli cheese bacon dish. I mean, it took well, four minutes. I mean, it took a, took a segment yeah, to actually absolutely. go to get an end. Gorgeous thing. Very easy. And the recipe is at watch.com. What's the next piece we're going to do? Next up is a game? roasted sweet potato, okay. sage, brown butter, okay. all in there. So That's you got easy. sage and sweet potatoes. This, is, this has been roasted in the oven. Okay, all how we're long did you roast that for? About 45 minutes okay. at 350. Okay? All right. So all we're going to do is simply peel it. So we want. And it's going to peel off pretty easy after basing that's the oven it. for a while. Yep. Let it get cool enough so you can handle it. Don't, don't burn your fingers. Sure. So I'm going to. That's good advice. Get <laughs> good bring advice, that yeah. Down. Write don't that do down. That. <laughs> Perfect. So a little bit of butter okay. going down in the pan. And how much is it? Does it matter how many potatoes and like how many you can serve? Four is okay. on the recipe. Uh, about one potato per person. Okay. You know? When you go ahead and multiply that, if you're serving for, you know, if you're doing, say, eight or ten this weekend, Same difference. you just go ahead and just yep. keep adding on. Okay. Absolutely. All right, so we're going to brown some butter. We're not going to burn some butter, okay? <laughs> There's a little bit of time. difference, right. okay? <laughs> you can run that on low heat then to brown it as opposed yeah. to burn it. Yep. I am going to turn it up just a little bit more, but you can start to see there's some caramelization going on in that pan, okay. starting to develop, and you'll smell some nuttiness coming off. Of and what's it. that caramelization going to do for the uh, the overall product? The that? flavor. Okay. Yeah,
nuance to the dish, okay? You know, I love it when you're in here, Chef, because everybody in the cast, everybody's like hovering. Yeah, they're just outside waiting the for that they're moment. Staring. So I'm going to take this time and I'm going to chop a little bit of fresh sage, okay? Okay. Sage and, you know, the holidays. You got to have that. Absolutely. That fresh. Fresh. <laughs> it, does, it does smell like that, sure. Absolutely. Mm. Oh, yeah, gosh, it does. It does. It smell that. It smells like Christmas. There you go. Take a whip. Don't, See, do not smell your TV set. See you the color sick. that's starting yep. to develop there? So we've got some caramelization. Perfect. We've so got about a minute left, Chef. Sage. We'll, uh, okay. We're going to yeah. go in there. And just going to put that in. You mash it up a little bit? Smash it down and okay. everything like that. And a little salt and pepper and you're done. Just and like that. You hit it with a little nutmeg. Bam. Easy. And done. And a little bit of heavy cream. Easy. That's breezy. It. Easy. Look so at that. It comes you out like show this. show a plate? Yeah, absolutely. The magical kitchen here at Good Day Columbia. Boom. It's done. There it is. Now imagine topping this with some candy pecans. Oh, wow. Or some maple syrup. Look at that. We got, so we got the broccoli. We got the broccoli cheese dish. Very easy. The sweet potatoes, very, very easy. And you've got a little turkey over here. Yeah, this is actually a pre fried turkey. Oh, my gosh. Yeah, absolutely. You want to do a little gravy on I top do of that? Do, I do a lot of gravy on top <laughs> of this. Are you kidding me? Look at this. This is awesome. You've got like an instant Thanksgiving dinner here. That's it. Without any stress. You can definitely impress a mother in law with this, or maybe just yourself. <laughs> if you're like me, me and my dog will be hanging out. It'll be all right, though. Oh, that is good. Look at that. Wow, done. Nice of course, everything done. available at the Chef Store right on St. Andrews Road. Uh, all the recipes, everything at Watch. Uh, Watch.com as well. The shopping list, recipes, and some other great ideas on how to make sure you pull your uh, Thanksgiving dinner together. Absolutely. Very easy. Absolutely. Chef Jason Scarborough. Man, I really appreciate you coming yeah. this morning. Yeah. And always beating us because it's a good time. Absolutely. I'm going to go ahead and dig in. We're going right. to make sure this go tastes good. As, as good as it looks. So there let's you give go. it a whirl. Just to make sure. Going for the broccoli. Here we go. Should work well with that gravy as well. Winner, winner, turkey dinner. And that is a roasted skillet gravy that we actually have at oh. the Chef Store as well. Easy.